Hi Aries, this is a quick preview of the reading I just uh, did for you. Uh, what I can say shortly is that you are being too much stressed out about uh, what happened with this relationship in the past and uh, you dropped all that burden, you gave up on the relationship. Now to watch the details of the reading, please uh, keep watching the video as uh, uh, you'll have all the details for the reading I just did. Hi Aries, this is uh, your general love reading. First, let's do four shuffles for you. And the last shuffle. So, we'll see the past, the present energies, what is the potential outcome, the overall energy and the advice uh, for you. So, let's see. What uh, we have for you, Aries, for the rest of September 2020. So... So the overall energy for the reading is Eight of Swords. Uh, Aries, you've been uh, quite a bit of stressed, I think, for the moment, thinking a lot, uh, maybe about your partner, ex-partner, how things uh, went, why did they go wrong, and they're feeling uh, a little bit hopeless, like there is no way out of the... Uh, situation or you being unable to solve it now for the past energies you have the ten of wands in the reverse they have the seven of pentacles in the reverse and the connection is two of swords so clearly in the past uh, you gave up you gave up on them you gave up on the relationship because uh, it was too much of a burden for you maybe you were doing all the work and uh, you were not feeling appreciated enough. They have the seven of pentacles uh, in the reverse, so it means even for them, they realize that uh, it was a waste of time. Like they 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 thought they invested invested on the relationship, but it was a waste of time. Uh, meanwhile, for the relationship, uh, the connection there was a two of swords. So. You wanted to move forward with the connection, but were unable to move on. Uh, I sense it was a difficult decision to make, uh, because uh, it, you, it was very, very hard to, to make a choice, uh, choice to stay in the current relationship or just to move on. But apparently you, you moved on, you dropped all that uh, burden. Now, for the present connection, uh, the overall overall energy for the connection is the Knight of Cups in the reverse. So, uh, someone or both of you lost uh, hope for uh, this relationship and uh, literally fell felt out of love. They don't have much hope for this connection with the stars in the reverse and they also may be in a long distance uh, from you and distant emotionally at the same time. Meanwhile, you are here emotionally uh, detached with the King of Swords and uh, thinking that you did the right decision. You uh, did a decision made on uh, facts, logics, and not heart. But uh, 
both of you for the current moment are are distant uh, emotionally and meanwhile for the uh, potential outcome you have the magician in the reverse so for the current being for the moment for the rest of september uh, i don't see much uh, progress towards this past uh, connection with the magician in the reverse the, the relationship is being stuck Meanwhile, the advice you have is the Ten of uh, Pentacles. So, let's see why the Ten of Pentacles there as an advice for Aries, please. You are still thinking about this connection and how things uh, went wrong. Why did you invest so much uh, there? Why did you believe them in the first time? Maybe the intuition told you that this wasn't the right one but uh, anyway you 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 gave more chances after chances to this connection so ace of swords judgment in the reverse and the page of wands in the reverse so regarding uh, this uh, relationship I see now that you know the truth with the Ace of Swords and uh, this truth uh, sets you free because you are not willing to give another chance to this relationship and uh, there is no communication, almost uh, lost optimism about this uh, love, lost optimism that uh, there could be something, uh, some uh, potential in this uh, relationship. So that was just a quick reading for you, Aries, and uh, I hope it helped. I plan on posting more frequently, so if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe, uh, so you will be notified about the new videos and also about the live free tarot readings I do from time to time here on YouTube. So. Until the next video, I wish you all the best and uh, bye for now.